what you're going to cook for us today. Well, I was thinking about what I'm going to make either an apple pie or a peach cobbler. What do you think about that? Pies. You know, Miss Kate, she loved to talk about pies. See, I'm not into pie making. I'm into pie eating. But remember my pecan honey pies? Those were really good. Mm -hmm. Who is that? Oh, J.L., Johnny Luke himself. Hey, Bubba. Hey, Mama Kay. Hey, buddy. This is Emily. You know I know before. Emily. You remember Emily? Nope. Just excuse him. He forgets everything. <laughs> so what y'all doing today? Well, I was thinking that we could... Well, I was thinking we were going to... We could take the boat out and try to... I was just going to take her out on the river, on the old... You know, catch some fish. Show her the ropes. You know. Yeah. Reeling back the years, you know, when I came up with the old scheme, you know, me and my girlfriend fixed to go fishing. The last thing I had on my mind was fishing. That's for sure. I'm like, yeah. Tell you what, I'll take y'all fishing. I, Miss Kay, watch my gun. I, th I think we got it. You think they really want you to go with them? Nope. So y'all want to catch some fish? Yes, yeah, sir. That was the plan. We were going to do it. I think our culture needs more grandpas riding along with grandson and girlfriend. You got old Papa here being your chaperone. What's your opinion on that? Well, yeah, it's, it's good. It's good. Enjoying the great outdoors and everything's above board. Now, Jean-Luc, never touch her below the neck until you sign the dotted line. <laughs> That's being a gentleman about it, you know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. That, that helps. Since my dating days, I've just noticed it doesn't take long for a girl to become a girlfriend. I'm there to try to point them on the path they should go. When you're young, you know, all you hear everybody, you know, on television and the internet, you know, sex, 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 oh, you know, what are we gonna do with ourselves? Don't even entertain that thought. The last thing I would want is one of them come to me and say, guess what, Papa? I mean, you know, I've got herpes, and I'm like, yeah, well, I know where that comes from. It's syphilis, gonorrhea, herpes. Wow. I'm like, I don't think so. Sounds like a good point. Better a good day's catch of fish than a lifetime of crabs. A little peck on the cheek, okay. But other than that, no. You go from happy, happy, happy to crabby, crabby, crabby. But I'm gonna go show you how to catch a fish. <laughs> On your first date and all, we just gonna kinda serrate him a little bit. See what I'm saying? Oh, I see yet? it. Oh, Bill Robertson. I cannot believe that you went out there and interrupted their date. Ugh, Phil. I think when you clean fish, it's a great first date. It's romantic. When's the last time on a date could you say, now that's dating? Look, hold on. This is the first time. Oh making my mouth water. That's disgusting. I'm sure Emily is loving every minute. Pull it. Mm. Are you? Oh, it's yeah. fantastic. It reminds me of one of our first dates. Mm. I love to talk about when we were dating. I was looking for a pioneer man, and I got it. Boy, he's got, he got, oh, an, old, man. He got an old hard head. But I'm, I'm different than most women. Mm. Now that is American dating. You know how they have the dinner and a movie? This would be fishing and a dinner. Hey, how you go? You got it. Fun. I'm trying to teach Emily the way of the pioneer women, and she's actually wanting to learn. 
And I know you want to get your hands in some more good old fish, don't you? Sounds good to me. Actually, I'm not going to let you. I love that about her. This is a pioneer woman's secret. The key to, especially a Robertson man's heart, <laughs> is through his stomach. Just between us. You know, everybody, you know, it's sex, sex. That only lasts shortly. That's enough of that. Nowadays, they're just all about sex. They think that's all that's important, but it's not. I want to bestow a little knowledge on these kids. You have breakfast, you have lunch, you have dinner, you have snacks, you have special treat night, popcorn night, and then dip and chip night. That's what you need to think about. It never hurts to have a good pan of cornbread either. I can't wait for our next double date.